Hello people, welcome back to my channel again. Here I am with another tutorial for you all DIY people. In this tutorial, I'm going to uh, show you how to add SSL certificates to your, your website. And uh, SSL certificate means uh, go from HTTP to HTTPS. Let's start now. You know, somewhere from last year, uh, Google had decided uh, uh, to give a notification uh, as soon you click on this. It, uh, it it gives you the information that your connection to this site is not secure. So it gives you the the warning and it gives you the, the information that uh, that site is not possibly safe uh, for a visit. So all these information, what you trade in on this, uh, can be compromised. Uh, maybe hackers can target to this. So uh, these SSL certificates uh, are generally. Uh, uh, issued by the by by the server uh, where, where you are posting your site, or possibly you could buy it from the third parties as well. Uh, these uh, SSL certificates are actually essential for the for the business websites. If you're running, if you're trying to run a uh, e-commerce website where you are just uh, trading uh, stuff uh, against money, or maybe you're just uh, uh, trading with uh, sensitive information, uh, credit card information, or maybe uh, where this information uh, could lead to some. A financial or uh, maybe uh, compromising uh, of a personal uh, data, but that is from the server side. There, there is a second part uh, which actually comes to the to the designing side. If you are designing a website yourself, so you uh, possibly uh, don't know uh, how you have to force uh, your web design uh, to go from HTTP to HTTPS. I'll show you how to activate your SSL certificate with your own design. So here we are with the with the, with the same uh, website which I had shown you in a, in my pre previous tutorial. This was uh, my my tutorial site which I just created uh, for another channel. My web host actually had released these certificates for my domain. It just need to be installed on my developing end. So let's head back to our dashboard and log in. Username and password. So here we are at our back end. So installing that SSL certificates, uh, uh, we will uh, just uh, do it by uh, by using uh, another plugin. So let's go add in. So the plugin which we, which we are going to search uh, is called Really Simple SSL. So here we are. Uh, if you if you just uh, uh, again, it says a very very uh, safe practice that before you're installing a plugin, just look into uh, what this uh, plugin does. Uh, no setup is required. You only need an SSL certificate, of course, which is uh, provided by your web host, and we have it already there. So, and this plugin to do the rest. So, this is uh, what this plugin does. And the same time, if you just look at the uh, the, the the five star rating, which is three thousand nine hundred ninety-three, it's pretty significant. And then if you look at the uh, active install, 4 million active installations. That's pretty remarkable. So that is a very trustworthy uh, plugin. So uh, if you look at the uh, last update, which is actually two weeks ago, pretty good. And then it also had uh, assessed the, uh, the, the version of our WordPress and it says compatible with the uh, version which had been installed on our computer. So just go ahead and install this, okay. So activate it as well. All right. So here it is. It's uh, it's it's already activated. So if you could just see that it say that I'll, I'll, it gives you all the information. Almost ready to migrate SSL. So let's say okay. They are also offering you to just uh, go ahead and uh, 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 buy their pro version too. But okay, the the pre version does a quite good job. I have it uh, almost. Uh, change my uh, almost all the websites with this one. So let's say go ahead and activate it. So, okay, it actually activated. That's why it locked me out because my uh, URL was on HTTP. And now after changing this, it will uh, change me to HTTPS. So we have to just uh, log in again uh, with my password. Very long one. All right, so here we are. So if you just go back, uh, uh, if you just want to see if you come to the settings here, and uh, you will see at the end of the settings, you will find uh, uh, the SSL uh, new menu had been added, a new new item has been added, but it gives you the information uh, what this uh, uh, SSL uh, activation and the uh, implementation of this has done. So say SSL is enabled. So 
an SSL certificate was detected on my web on on my site. So the the server had already assigned the uh, the certificate for for this uh, domain. So uh, this uh, redirect has been there uh, has been there. Okay. So th th this there is this option here, which is telling you. Uh, WordPress uh, 301 redirect, redirect enabled. We recommend uh, to enable uh, 301 with HT access. Uh, I did on a few websites and then I had some conflict with this. I have to revert it back. So uh, you try it, uh, just uh, enable it and uh, um, uh, you see possibly uh, will not give you trouble because my website was quite complex where I had the problem. Uh, so I had to, to revert it back. Uh, so otherwise, uh, uh, this is what you need. Uh, so a 301 redirect is already uh, is set in, in WordPress. So normally your site, uh, everybody who will try to type uh, your URL, it will be forcibly uh, uh, transferred to, to the HTTPS. And if you just want to see the clear information here, if you just click on general, and if you look at the URL, uh, I don't know if you remember that when you had typed in your initial URL, so this URL was having HTTP, but now after adding this SSL certificate uh, with this uh, plugin, it had added HTTPS here. And not only this, it will force the uh, the visitor to the, uh, to the HTTPS site and all these uh, uh, Callings uh, which goes through uh, your script and your your web page will be uh, transferred to the HTTPS uh, address. A certificate installation has done. Uh, just let's go and visit uh, our uh, website and see if we had this uh, padlock on to our website or not. So here here we go. So here you can just see that lock shows that your site is uh, secure. So view visit uh, information if you just see that connection is secure. So here it is, uh, uh, your uh, certificate uh, has been installed. Thanks for watching. If you think this video was of value, uh, please give me a thumbs up. Share this video with your fellow, fellow developers. If you still did not subscribe to my channel, so please uh, click the subscribe button and click the bell icon at the same time to get the notification for my next video. So till then, have a nice day.